Okay, box squat, chair squat, bench squat, cooler squat, whatever we can squat on that we are comfortable with, that's what we are going to sit down and stand up on with the intention of as it gets easier, we wanna try to go lower and sit lower on something to get more range of motion. All right, so I'm first gonna show you a seated squat with a chair. So your feet are gonna be just outside of your hips, toes maybe slightly out, and your hips are gonna move back. That's the first thing that's gonna to move to put the weight in your heels, okay? So you're gonna push your hips back like you've got a bag full of groceries and we need to shut that car door. You're gonna push your hips back, sit down in the chair completely, and then stand up, all right? So we're gonna sit down and we're gonna stand up, just like we get on and off the couch, just like we get on and off the toilet, this is going to be beneficial for us for right now, okay? So we're gonna sit down and we're gonna stand up. As that gets easier with our body weight, we can grab a pair of dumbbells and hold a pair of dumbbells, okay? And squat down and squat up. Squat down and squat up, okay? But if you have something that you can squat to that's going to be lower and give you more range of motion let's go that route first so first we'll start here with no weight as that gets easier if we have something that we can go down lower to then we're going to go there with no weight and we're going to squat down and squat up squat down and squat up okay and then as that gets easier then we want to use weight from there but if we don't have something that we can squat down lower to then we'll start with a chair or the bench or a box. Start with body weight first and then with the intention of going up in weight as that gets easier.